the second one, what was the second one? What was my second one? Free. Hey, it's Jason with JLM Photography, and today I've got Emmy working with me. Hello. So Emmy is a high school senior. I do have permission from her mom to be able to do this video, as well as Emmy. Um, but I've had some people ask me to show like a senior shoot. Now she doesn't have her cap and gown, but we're still gonna shoot it anyway, senior pics. And so really what this is, is Emmy is one of my senior reps and I have a senior rep program and that's kind of one of the little things that I wanna talk about in this video is some of the things that helped me kind of get a foot into the door as a high school senior photographer. It's not easy, it's a lot harder than I actually thought it would be. And it's taken me a lot more years to get like a foot into the yeah. door. I just kind of want to describe a little bit of kind of what I did and what helped me um, get a foot in the door as a senior photographer. And again, thank you so much for my beautiful model working with me today. Um, you're going to get some behind the scenes photos from the shoot, as well as me talking to the camera, behind the camera, talking to Emmy. We're going to go and get some photos. Yeah? yeah. Fantastic. Enjoy. All right. <laughs> So we had a little accident. Um, I didn't fall on, but my stand fell in the water. I had to basically almost go swimming. But Emmy still looks beautiful. You do have something right here on your arm. Or is it just water? Is it just water? I can, <laughs> I can edit that out. Okay. So I switched my lights because it's raining a little bit and I just want to um, Keep shooting. Ready? One, two, three. One, two, three. Fantastic. Two and three. One of the first things that I think you really need to do as a, um, if you're wanting to get in the senior market, is work on posing. Um, can we use the little post? And now, of course, it's raining a little bit. Give me just a second. Work on posing. Um, I think it's extremely important that your seniors want to actually share the photos. And if you don't know how to pose and they don't look good in the photos, they're not gonna share them. You have to be in their space. Their space is Instagram and TikTok. And if they don't wanna share the photos, they're not gonna do it. Go ahead and get back under an umbrella because I know it's going. So something that you really need to do is actually learn to pose. And so I started working with models several years ago. I've done a couple videos on that and posing is extremely critical. Being able to work with the models, I was able to learn to pose and I kind of translated that into my senior sessions. As you can see from Emmy's work, she does not need me to pose her at all, but you're not gonna have that every time you work with a senior. There's a lot of seniors that don't know how to pose and are very uncomfortable posing. The more comfortable you can make them at posing or you can instill that confidence um, and show them a little bit of feedback, it kind of goes a long way in that photo session where they can see hey, these do look good and I look good and the poses look great. So work on the posing, that's the first thing that really will help, I think, um, with senior photos. <laughs> One, two, three. Beautiful. Two and three. Yes. Fantastic, Emmy. Beautiful. We're shooting here in Fredericksburg um, at this little pond, Das Peach House, I think is what it is. And it's just absolutely fantastic. Love it, Emmy. It is so nice when you can work with somebody who is just able to work on her own like this and I mean just absolutely incredible. I'm using the Rotolite EOS. It's not really waterproof or water resistant but I trust I would rather it get wet than my Godox light so fantastic. One, two, three. Two and three. Gorgeous. 
So here's the part that a lot of photographers don't want to hear, and this is, again, my opinion on how I think you need to get into the senior market. Go ahead, Emmy, switch. Is you need to offer some free sessions. And the reason you're going to offer some free sessions is, is you need um, to actually have some seniors in your portfolio. And if nobody's going to pay for you, you need to be able to get those people to pay for you. Beautiful work, Emmy. Yes. What if we do a, a little standing shot right behind and you go a foot up? So maybe like in here? Like how, like this? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, y'all could, I could just do a video of Emmy posing <laughs> and maybe that should be a video, just some posing tips and techniques, but absolutely incredible. Yes, perfect. Not blacking the face either. One, two, three. Uh, so free really helps. It's a, I, I started doing that because I needed to get some clients. And again, if you want to shoot with seniors, they have to know who you are. Uh, parents have to be able to trust you. And that's, to me, that's how I did it. And I think free is a great tip it doesn't pay bills, but maybe you'd offer the session for free and have them pay for photos. But I think free is a, is a good thing. Um, it's not gonna pay the bills, but what? Throwing one in there, exactly, it does. It does, uh, one of the things that I did on my Instagram was as I was trying to grow it, is I would offer some giveaways. And of course I did more giveaways at the beginning than I do now, but I would offer some giveaways and they were giveaways for senior sessions and it helped me build a senior portfolio and it allowed me to get my work out there and hopefully those seniors shared my work, which they did. So that's what you really need to do um, is basically get, get your work out there. Outfit change? Okay, Outfit change. So I wanna show basically how we have this one set up. So you can see we got all this stuff all over the place, but it's gonna look like we're right in the thick of these woods and it's fantastic. Yeah. Right there should be good. As long as I don't fall in the water, I'm fine. The hardest part with using this roto light is there's not it's not flashing. So she, I need to kind of let her know when it's going. Beautiful. Yes. Also, oh, and I just messed it up. As I was getting ready to tell you, let your model set. I didn't let her set. Beautiful. Fantastic. Good. You, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Careful, careful. I like the layup. Yep, yep, perfect. Let me get up here closer for that. One, two, three. Oh, these colors. Two and three. Beautiful. So one of the last things that I would say to become a good senior photographer or to get into that senior photographer market. And you might not necessarily understand what I'm fully talking about, but I have um, rep programs and there's a lot of senior photographers who have rep programs. But as much as I love working with seniors like Emmy, you actually have to build up a brand. And so that's where I've developed a teen rep program, a teen modeling program. And so what I found out right away, What I found out right away when I was really starting to get into the senior market is shooting with a senior, it's a one and done. And I didn't really have that um, long-term type uh, effect, you know? So I would shoot with one or two seniors, three or four seniors, and then it's gone. And so I was like, what can I do to actually build up a brand in the high schools? And it said, hey, just do a senior rep program for teens instead or underclassmen. And so that's what I've done. Plus it allows them to kind of build that confidence. They get to hang out with parents and do something completely different than a normal thing that you might do as a teenager. And so um, it has really worked well for me. It allows me to maybe work with some of these teens over a couple years. And by the time you get to the senior sessions, they're absolutely incredible. Uh, maybe look at, instead of just a senior rep program, consider a teen modeling type program to be able to work with the underclassmen and build up. And so that would be tip number three of how I would kind of get into that senior market. 
So let's see here. Um, what if I bring it out a little bit more and take a step this way? Yeah. Again, we've got that tree right there. One, two, three. Beautiful. Two and three. Gorgeous. Are you able to do one of the little squatted shots with this? Yeah, I like that. Yes, yes. Yeah, chin up just a tiny bit for the light. Incredible. Yeah, this is a great pose right here. It's one of my favorite poses. One, two, three. Beautiful. Oh, these colors are absolutely incredible. Ah, oh, fantastic. Can we go here? Yes. Gorgeous. Thank you so much, Emmy. We can pop you back up. Yes, fantastic. Let's see here. Let's bring this up just a little bit. One, two, three. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Slide to your left just a little bit. There we go. Yes. Beautiful. <laughs> Have you really thought about modeling at all? Have you ever thought about it? You ought to consider it. Even in college, consider it. You're good. I don't just tell you to butter you up. What if we kind of pull it a little bit close like it's a little cold? Yes. I caught your blink on that one. One, two, three. Gorgeous. Yes. Beautiful. Very good. I like that. Real soft and subtle down. Yeah. One, two, three. Basically, that's the end of the session. We're still gonna shoot a little bit more, but I just really wanted to say, first of all, thank you so much for letting me cut into your senior session to do this. But again, you're looking at, again, some of my posing, or my tips is posing, learn to pose, learn to pose, learn to pose. It's very, very important for your seniors to love their images, to share them out. Uh, the second one is you might have to offer some free sessions. And basically, in order to kind of build a senior portfolio, if you don't have access to seniors, you might have to actually offer some free giveaways or something like that. Um, you don't have to do everything free if you don't want to do everything free, but maybe the session free and purchase picks and stuff like that. So, but again, free really helps. If you've got to build that portfolio, free is the best way to do it. And the last one is definitely consider um, senior rep programs. Uh, they allow you to work with multiple seniors. I've got um, a senior rep program this year that basically has eight seniors from one school. They're one dance team. It's incredible. But don't limit it to the senior session or senior rep program because the team modeling program to me is actually just as important, if not more so, because you need to build the brand over the course of years. And what better way to do that with 9th, 10th, and 11th graders that will eventually go into the senior session. Um, and so having rep programs kind of designed around those two age groups really helps get into that senior market yeah and emmy agrees so with since emmy agreed that's going to be it if you like what you see please like comment and subscribe hit the little bell for notifications and if you want to give her a comment in the in the youtube video comments please let us know how she did and i will pass it along yes. so thank you so much for watching and until next time keep shooting